Okay, question 9. Which would behave the least like an ideal guest at room temperature? Least like an ideal guest basically is asking which one has the, the strongest or the highest attraction among its molecule. Okay, the highest intermolecular attraction. So, understand that molecules we can have IDID, PDPD, or hydrogen bonding and all that so we have to check and compare now carbon dioxide helium hydrogen and nitrogen okay it'll be good to memorize quite a few of those that appears pretty common uh, pretty often all these four are actually non-polar so they are actually attracted to the, uh, the molecules are attracted to each other by instantaneous dipole induced dipole id id so it is it's the same for all four of them if they are all id id then we have to consider which one has the the highest mr because the high the higher your mr is the more electrons you have the stronger your id id attraction will be so going down the list we have 44 for carbon dioxide 4 for helium, 2 for hydrogen, and 28 for hydrogen. Right? You can check your periodic table to add up the MR. What this means is we expect carbon dioxide to have the highest MR. It would have the most number of electrons. We will expect its induced dipole to be the highest. We will expect its attraction among the carbon dioxide molecules to be the highest. And then it will be the least like to be an ideal guess. Okay, it behaves least likely as an ideal guess. Number 10. Number 10 is we need to change the gas equation in the form or to have the subject of MR. So we start off with the one that we usually are familiar with. PV equals to NRT. So how do we change it in the form of MR? We must know that N, your number of moles, is equal to mass over relative molecular mass. So we have your moles changed to mass over molecular mass. RT remains the same. Pressure and volume remains the same. And then we just need to change or swap them around until your MR is the subject. We bring MR up. Okay, leave the MRT on the right side and your PV you divide it across and we have this expression 